All right, let's talk for a second. Monday night football game. That that does it for the pooped in the big boy pants section. Tomorrow we'll get into waiver wire stuff. Uh, we'll get you set up for the playoffs. Hopefully you're doing well. I had a lot of uh, tweets from people that were doing well. Some guys, you know, they're still in the fight. They're still in the fight heading into Monday night. So Cowboys, they go, they take on the Redskins. I think the Redskins are going to win this game. Somebody has to win this game. The NFC East. I heard something. What is going on? I heard something like. Are if, the Eagles going to win it now? <laughs> if the Cowboys beat the Redskins, they're only like a game back. Yes, or something. and that is a fact. <laughs> That's why they haven't put Tony Romo on season yeah. ending. Yeah. And, and there was a lot of people chuckling about that. And when I heard, I said, yeah, why not? Well, they could win it. They definitely could win it because just when you rely on the Redskins to do and, something, and it doesn't the seem Giants, to happen. Ugh. Giants it, lost. Eagles won. Someone's getting in under 500. And it's it was really funny when you see the standings of like the divisional leaders. I mean, you got the Panthers, 12 wins. The Cardinals are at 10 wins. Uh, Vikings, Packers. The, yeah, which the Packers are what, nine? They're both they, eight and four. Eight and four? Yep. And then you have the NFC East. Not so hot. <laughs> but let's talk Take about a moment, them. A moment of silence. Let's talk about them right now. Des Bryant, Darren McFadden, Jason Witten. What is your confidence level for the Cowboys? Minimal. Uh, yeah, I Darren, st- Darren McFadden, if you're in a PPR league. Yeah. You don't think Des Bryant? I would start Des if I have to. Yeah. I, <laughs> no, so I, if you have to start I, him, you would start him. I yeah. still start him, but... Sage. What? Are you, <laughs> what? He's I'm making call, fun of the fact I'm calling that I said, him a sage. He said if you have to start a guy, he'd start oh. him. I just think it's kind of a... Well, my point it's is... Not, it's not very prescriptive my, to my, somebody. My point is, I think that... <laughs> There are a lot of teams. I have Des on one of my leagues where I'm I'm starting Sammy Watkins. I started Sammy Watkins over him this week. So let's make it easy. Des Bryant or Deshaun Jackson tonight? Des Bryant. Deshaun was my sit of the week. I don't think Dallas is like I said with Ted Ginn Jr. I don't think they're a team that's going to give up the play to the Deshaun Jackson type player. Is this Alfred Morris time? Is his time coming this season? Mike is shaking his head the way that you do when you talk about starting Alfred Morris. I mean, I, I guess so. If, if, let, if you're going to go Alfred Morris or Matt Jones, let's say they're both on your bench, I would go I'm going to go with Alfred Morris. I agree, but it's just a bad matchup. This, Jordan you know, Reed? I, I, mean, I didn't like him coming into tonight, but yeah. This is, this is just a black <laughs> hole of fantasy you know uh, what's going to happen. Which you know what it means. It's yeah, gonna be this 50. is going to be 50 to 59 <laughs> points, and it's just going to be nuts because looking at this game, it just seems like nothing is going to happen. You, you've got a good defense on Dallas against you know a, a mediocre well, Washington. In, but they're good at home is the, the situation with Washington. They have been good defensively at home over the past couple games. So you, you are right about that. That in spirit, yes.